If you have not reached an agreement with your seller, you may go to My DH Gate, and then you would go under Refund and Dispute under Active Orders. From here, you will find your order number and click on View, Return, and Refund. You can see that the date for you to request DH Gate mediation is October 26th. This date is five days after you have requested a seller agreement. However, if your seller does not agree to your proposal, you can click on Request DH Gate Mediation. Here you will have to choose a dispute reason. You can choose from item not received, item not as described, or other reason for return. After you have chosen that, you'll have to specify in what way your item was not as described. And then you can tell them, and then you can tell DHGate what the outcome is that you expect. There is partial refund, full refund, or full refund list for returned item. And then you'll click whether you want the shipping fee to be paid by you or the seller. Here it says awaiting your evidence. You will have to submit evidence five days after submitting your proposal. Um, if the item, if the reason that you are requesting DHgate mediation is because you have not received your items, there can be two cases. Um, if your item is under custom regulations, you'll have to provide a, a photo evidence of the customs letter. If the reason that you are requesting DHgate mediation is because your items were not received and they were never received, then the seller is supposed to provide the photo evidence. However, if the items that you are requesting DH gate mediation are due to the fact that they're not as described in the original image, you can click on upload file and browse and you'll look for you'll provide photo evidence of what items are missing or where the item is damaged.